What is up guys, Windows 18 Max here and today I'm going to be showing you how to recover your Surface device from Windows 10 to Windows 8.1. Now the whole reason why I'm going to be showing you guys this today is because when I did an exchange of my broken Surface Pro 3, they gave me a new Surface Pro 3, but they had it already installed with Windows 10. Now me, I don't really like uh, Windows 10 on my Surface device since it was designed and built around Windows 8 and Windows 8.1 and um, yeah let's get started what is up guys so what you're gonna wanna do is click the link in the description and then uh, it will bring you to this site that will bring you to the Surface answer desk and what you wanna do is um, select one of your products uh, which mine would be the Surface Pro 3. This is the one that I uh, that I had replaced because it has Windows 8.1 on it. So I'm going to select that one and then click on continue. And then from here what you want to do is select the warranty services and recover and then recovering the system and then go ahead and select continue. And then from here, it will say um, you're going to go to the resources on the right here. And what you want to do is select the using a Surface, a Surface USB recovery device. So what you want to do is click on create a USB recovery drive. And then it says download a recovery image for your surface. I'm going to click on that. And then I will select my surface pro three again. And then click on continue and then I'll click on download now if you uh, look at the download here it says surface pro 3 BMR 10 5.268.1 that means that it's going to be Windows 8.1. If you see one that has um, just 10 on it, I'll give you a look at what it will be. In the Windows 10, it will be this one right here. As you see, that your file uh, would be similar to that. It will be 10.34. And then the Windows 8.1, that's right here, which is the same one being downloaded, is 10 underscore 5.268. And that will be the Windows 8.1 recovery. Now since I already have this downloaded, I'm going to cancel it. And then... What you're going to want to do is plug in your USB flash drive. Once it's plugged in, go to this PC. And then what you're going to want to do is right click it and format and then restore to device device defaults. If the device default is not FAD32, it might be NTFS. What you want to do is click on the file system and then change it to FAD32. And then make sure it says quick format and then you're going to start it 
and uh, you're going to want to click OK here. Just make sure that your flash drive is backed up if there's any contents on it. But for me, I'm going to click Cancel because I already have the recovery there. And then once it's formatted, you're going to go to your Downloads. But I have mine already backed up in my Windows installation. And I'll open it. And then I'll click on Extract All. And then I'll browse to my flash drive, which is right there. Select folder. And then you could make it show the extract files when completed, but I'm not. And then you're going to click extract. It shows there's not enough space because I already have the files on there, but um, yours will run normally with the copying it over to the flash drive. Alright guys, so another thing you guys want to do is go ahead and click the second link in the description and it will bring you to the recovery key for BitLocker and what you want to make sure is that you um, get your um, key ID for your Surface device. This is mine and then this is my recovery key. So what I'm going to do with this is just take a quick uh, picture of it uh, and um, as we're recovering it, we're going to need to put this recovery key in. Alright guys, so a few things you're going to want to do first is make sure that all your um, personal files are backed up on your device and that it is plugged in with your USB flash drive connected to it. And then you're going to turn uh, off your device. I'm going to forcibly shut down mine. Once that is completed, I'm going to press the down button on the volume keys and power on the device and continuing holding down the volume uh, down key and that will force it to boot from flash drive and for now I'm going to keep my BitLocker key uh, on my device so that I have it at um, easy access and we're gonna go United States English and US and then troubleshoot reset your PC and enter in that recovery key once you have it in just go ahead and click on continue and then select your targeted operating system and then from here click on next and I'm gonna select on yes repartition the drives so then it um, formats the drive completely and re-puts in the Windows 8.1 recovery partition so then the recovery partition is always going to be there so then it will whenever I need to recover it if I ever do it won't recover it back to Windows 10 and then I'm gonna select um, fully clean the drive and then I'm going to click on reset now this process can take about 45 minutes to an hour and a half alright so once you get here what you're gonna wanna do is um, if you have a type cover like me what you're gonna do is press function and F12 but if you do not then um, it will have a keyboard icon up here somewhere but for me since I have the type cover connected it's not showing me the option to show a keyboard alright you're gonna press function and F12 
for it to clear the trusted platform module information so then it will reset it to the Windows 8.1 um, operating system trusted platform module so then it will be set up for Windows 8.1 Alright guys, and that is it. Now your Surface device should be Windows 8.1. It is Windows 8.1 Pro. Just make sure you have your Surface Pen at hand. Alright, now I'll put a link in the description for the recovery image for you guys if you guys don't have a Windows 8.1 recovery image at all for yourself to download but that's it this has been brought to you by Windows 8 Team Hacks like comment and subscribe